Welcome to beautiful Tampa, Florida. We are here during the Gasparilla Festival, which means that Tampa Bay has been invaded by thousands of pirates from all across the nation. This should make for some pretty interesting photographic opportunities. So let's go see what we can find. In this episode, the Gasparilla pirate invasion takes over the city by the bay. The streets fill with rum-soaked seafaring criminals sporting the skull and crossbones. And ordinary people shed their flip-flops and t-shirts in favor of muskets, cutlasses, and frilly feathered hats. But that's not all, because just beyond these drunken festivities, there stands the beautiful city of Tampa. Towering skyscrapers cast mirror images into the shimmering waterways, setting the scene for an incredible vision of cityscape photography. Welcome to Florida. Clear skies, pristine beaches, and all the Mai Tais you can drink. The year-round sunshine brings in people from all across the nation. So if you're tired of shoveling snow and you need a break from the icy grip of winter, this is the place to be. Tampa is a unique city. It's small enough that you can walk around the whole place pretty comfortably. And it's big enough to give us that grand sweeping skyline that makes for epic cityscape photography. This pedestrian friendly sensibility of the local river walk allows us to dial in our location just perfectly. Furthermore, the waterways leading into the city are crisscrossed with a series of bridges, and these provide front row seats to the best views in town. Our first location gets us right up close and personal with the Hillsborough River, which leads from the city's intercoastal waterways to the salty banks of Tampa Bay. And here is where things get tricky. This is the Platte Street Bridge. During the day, it's a mild-mannered roadway with minimal cars. However, in the evening, when the light becomes more favorable for cityscape photography, this bridge turns into a giant demolition drag race of angry motorists locked into an intense battle to reach their favorite places for beer and crab legs. The bridge becomes a violent war zone of blaring car horns, shouted obscenities, and extended middle fingers. In other words, it's not a safe place for an innocent photographer to be standing along the side of the road. Fortunately, this particular bridge offers a nice concrete retaining wall to help separate the rage-induced motorists from the pedestrian walkway. The lesson here is simple. When you are shooting from a busy road, always be sure to tuck yourself into a safe place. Never compromise your safety for a photograph. And so, with the beer and crab brigade creating maximum chaos behind us, the view ahead is nothing short of serenity. Skyscrapers reach into the crisp night air as the city comes to life. Colored lights paint the bridges and walkways. And beneath it all, a surreal vision of the upside down city takes shape in the reflecting waters of the bay. Our first images are turning out just beautifully. And despite the turbulent swarm of traffic at our backs, this cityscape photography expedition is off to a great start. Tampa is a city of many flavors. We find ourselves in the midst of a colorful mixture of culture, architecture, education, and of course, nature. Florida is home to an incredible cross-section of plants and animals. And in a place where the land meets the ocean, we discover exquisite diversity in our local wildlife. Let's be realistic. If you happen to be traveling with your family, the wife and kids will eventually need a break from trekking around with tripods. And the Florida Aquarium is a great place to spend the day. Here we explore the mysteries of the ocean, 
and all the while earn a few extra photography points so that we can once again set out for our next location. And now that we're back on the hunt, we aim our sights on a different vision of the city. For our first location, we were up close and personal. Right about here, in fact. Now it's time to take a step back and get a new perspective of the city from a broader vantage point. Our new location gives us a little extra breathing room and allows for a wide sweeping panoramic version of our city skyline. On this evening, we find a small scattering of clouds painted by the setting sun. They offer up a little extra color for our new skyline. Afternoon light fades through the blue hour and our new images come to life. Long exposures help to streamline the ripples across the bay, turning the water into a soft cloud of light and color. The lens soaks in the street lamps, colored floodlights, and twinkling skyscraper windows. Yet another beautiful evening settles over Florida and the Tampa Bay Cityscape Expedition comes home with a brilliant new series of images for the gallery wall. But this is not the end of the story. In fact, this is just the beginning. Cityscapes are definitely one of my favorite genres in all of photography. However, if you have been paying attention, you may have noticed one small catch. One second we're standing on location, and in the next instant we have a perfectly produced fine art image that is ready for the gallery wall. Now, as you know, pictures don't just manifest out of thin air looking perfect, which means that we are obviously skipping a whole bunch of steps right down the middle. So, if you are interested in learning everything it takes to create amazing cityscape images for your next photography expedition, we have just the online course for you. Premium Light Academy has spent the last two years producing the ultimate cityscape photography tutorial collection. We take you to some of the most beautiful cities in America and provide step-by-step -step instructions on how you can capture winning cityscape images every single time. We showcase best practices for shooting on location and we take you through our entire post-production process with Lightroom and Photoshop. Sign up today and learn to capture beautiful city skylines like a pro. Experience the joy of travel like never before and always come home with stellar images. And now, with our shameless self-promotion safely out of the way, it's time to say goodnight to the beautiful city of Tampa. Our adventure wraps up with an elegant set of new images for the photography portfolio. From here, we set our sights on our next photography adventure. And I, for one, can't wait to see where the camera will take us next. All right, friends, as always, thank you so much for joining us. Now, if you have any cool cityscape photography stories that you would like to share, please drop them in the comments below. We would love to hear from you. Furthermore, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. We have a lot of cool new stuff coming up, and I don't want you to miss out. That's going to do it for this time, so we'll see you in the next lesson.